I love KiCad software. The workflow of adding curved traces, however, is very frustrating for me. While I had a moment, I thought I'd make a video of the current workflow as it stands. Here's a PCB where I want to draw some curved traces around the inner perimeter to connect this IC to two series resistors and then another IC. I cannot start an arc from the endpoint, and KiCad does not contain Bezier drawing tools. To draw an arc, I need to pre-plan a center point around which I will draw a partial circle or arc. As you can see, I've added some center crosshairs to my PCB drawing layer as a guide. I draw the arcs, roughly guessing my start and end point. Unfortunately, KiCad doesn't know that these will eventually be traces, so it cannot enforce DRC spacing rules. Now that I've drawn these arc shapes, I need to create from selection and create tracks from selection. Then I press the delete key to delete the selected graphic. Now I have traces, but they have no net. I need to go to properties for each trace and assign it to a net. Now I can draw the rest of the trace to the component. If I make a mistake, there is no way to shorten or lengthen the arc. I'll need to redraw it. Split track doesn't work on curved tracks. You may be tempted to try the track corner mode, which allows you to draw curves. However, the results aren't really something you have any control over. Each click starts an arc in almost a random direction. So if you don't want to draw arcs first, the best current method to do curve traces may be the fillet tracks feature. First, we'll want to change the interactive router settings from walk around to highlight collisions and turn on free angle mode. This will allow us to draw traces that are not at a 45 or 90 degree angle. Now we can draw an approximation with multiple segments, and then when we're done, press U to select the entire trace, and then choose fillet tracks. With a value of 10 millimeter radius, I got a fairly smooth, if wonky, curve. So I posted some of my thoughts on curve traces in Discord and in the forums in a general way, seeking community feedback and suggestions. Let's just say I got some pushback on that. For bugs and small issues, I think it's perfectly fair to ask users to not only define the problem, but propose a solution or describe the desired behavior. However, for curved traces, I did not feel that I was qualified to propose solutions when the problem itself had not been clearly defined. Even with fillet tracks and the graphic to trace conversion feature, curve traces and keycad are still clunky to create in a way that I want to create them. That's why I created the forum thread, so that someone smarter than me could propose ideas and give solutions I wasn't even aware of. Alas, I was strongly encouraged to make use of the issue tracker, even if my proposed solutions are dumb, so bring on the dumb. I have created three issues in the bug tracker. Number one, an upgrade to the create trace from graphic feature, which would streamline net selection. Number two, a pen or bezier tool that would allow us to create and extend bezier or spline curves, which KiCad already supports internally, but does not expose a method to create. Number three, allow the use of break track in the middle of a curve trace. If you like these suggestions, please go to the links in the description and upvote them. If you feel there are additional solutions that might help with curved traces, by all means, please add them to the KiCad issue tracker. What do you think? Would you use such a tool? Are you already happy with the existing tools and feel this would be a poor expenditure of time versus other priorities? Chime in in the comments below. Contribute to KiCad development if you can, and as always, thanks for watching.